this video is gonna be another quick one with React Native. So we're just gonna be looking at how you might do some sort of authentication um, very simply. So we're not gonna actually have like an authentication with uh, a password or a sign up or anything like that, but we're just gonna show you how you could restrict uh, some pages based on that. So um, let's come in here. This is from our last video. This is where we uh, got up to. So this is, uh, we just have a couple components here. One's a home screen, one's a detail screen. So that's good. And then we just have our navigation set up here. And again, we went over this in the last video. If you haven't seen that and need to uh, have a primer on React navigation, there you go. It's in that video. So let's get into here. Um, so we're just gonna pretend like we had some sort of call to an API or something to test if we are logged in or not. Um, this could be checking async storage for some sort of cookie, whatever you want. All right, so let's just go like this. We're gonna go const and we're gonna say auth and set auth. And we're just gonna kinda uh, mock some sort of authentication here. And then we'll go use state and we will call use state and inside here we'll just set this to false to start with okay and then down here let's bring this up a little bit okay so we're just gonna say you have to be authenticated to uh, go to the details page so before uh, the most recent React navigation, this was a little bit tougher, but now they've made it very simple and similar to like kind of a web authentication flow that you might be used to. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna come in here and we're gonna go below the uh, stack navigator and we're gonna come in and we are going to do, uh, we're gonna say auth, Actually, let's put this brackets here and go auth. And if it is auth, so we're gonna do a uh, uh, ternary, 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 ternary. So we're just gonna open up some brackets and here we're just gonna say auth and we are going to do question marks. We're gonna do a ternary operation here and open up some brackets and then we're gonna bring this down below here and then we will have our colon for our secondary. And so if we're authenticated, uh, actually let's go not auth. So if we're not authenticated, we're gonna go to the home screen. And then if we are, we're gonna show the details page. So let's go ahead and save that. And the auth is set to false to start. So we should uh, and actually, let's get rid of this initial route, I think. So if we are authenticated, we are gonna go to the details again. And if we're not like this, we are gonna go to the home screen. So let's just save that and see if that works first. And use state we haven't brought in yet. So let's go up here and we'll go react use state. Save that, come back. And we are at the home home page here. And navigate doesn't work right now because our we messed up our thing. Let's save that. So we are not authenticated currently. So that means that we're going to the home screen. Now, if we flip this to true, we think we should be able to go to our um to our details page. So let's save that and come back over here and you can see we have loaded with the detail page. So that's kind of basically how you would do auth. Uh, you would basically have, and you could have multiple of these, whatever you wanted if you had multiple components and kind of um, secure them that way. So you can have two different uh, navigators and basically go depending on if you're authenticated or not. Um, so obviously we just mocked this out and it's kind of sketchy, but uh, hopefully that was helpful to get you started. And uh, yeah, if you like the video, go ahead, subscribe or uh, give it a like. And until next time, thanks for watching.